In disc golf, most of the time, the last throw you make on a hole will be a putt. Disc golfers use two main types of putts, the spin putt, which will be demonstrated by Des Redding, and the pitch putt, which will be demonstrated by Jay Redding. Let's begin with the grip. The grip for the putt is similar to that of the backhand, just a bit looser and more delicate. Here, Jay has his fingers underneath the disc with his index finger along the outside of the rim. Many players use this grip for maximum accuracy and control, whether they're doing the spin putt or the pitch putt. Most people who spin putt use an inline stance like Des. Her front foot points towards the target with her back foot behind. Notice how she shifts her weight backwards then forwards prior to releasing the disc. This rocking motion adds needed power to her throw. The throwing motion for the spin putt is similar to that of a regular backhand. Notice how Des curls her arm into her chest and as it unwinds, her wrist snaps and the disc is flicked towards the basket. As we've said before, follow through is key. See how she finishes with her arm reaching out and her back leg raised for balance. Now Jay will demonstrate the pitch putt, which is most often used with a straddle stance. His feet are just wider than shoulder width apart and his knees are bent. Starting with his arm down low, he then brings it up and flicks the disc towards the basket. This is more of a down and up throwing motion than the back and forth throwing motion of the spin putt. He finishes the putt with a strong follow through, reaching out to the basket. Although we've distinguished between the spin putt and the pitch putt, and the inline stance and the straddle stance, the fact of the matter is that most players kind of mix and match the different styles of putting. A misplaced spin putt can carry a disc far beyond the basket, where a pitch putt is more likely to simply drop out of the air close to the basket. For most players, spin putts are preferred for putting longer distances. Then again, there are some players who will only pitch putt and some who will only spin putt. It really is a matter of personal preference. Long drives might look spectacular, but accurate putting is the key to success in disc golf. As in regular golf, you drive for show, you putt for dough. Let's review the spin putt. Grip the disc comfortably. With your leading foot pointing toward the target, take your inline stance. While shifting your weight for more power, flick the disc toward the target. Let's review the pitch putt. Grip the disc comfortably. Use a straddle stance with your feet about shoulder width apart and your knees bent. As your arm comes up with a pitching motion, Flick the disc for a stable flight. <laughs>